Morning, YouTube people, world, everywhere, wherever. Anyway, hopefully you guys are good. Hopefully you guys are all uh, doing good. Hopefully you guys, nobody has the coronavirus. Hopefully you guys are all doing what you're being told uh, to stay home. Um, if I was told to stay home, I would stay home. However, I'm being told to work, so I have to work. And, uh, yeah, I just wanted to say hi to everybody out there. Um, and hopefully everybody is good. Um, it's a pretty serious sickness. It's on my mind. Um, I think about it at night. Like, I don't know. You know, I work around diesel trucks all day. Um, work out there on the railroad with equipment. And, uh, I come home and... You know, I got to get some stuff out of my lungs, and I'm thinking, oh, crap, I'm going to die. I got the coves, and uh, I don't know. It's a serious thing. I think about, you know, a kid's working. He has to work. He works for the county, so he has to work, and he has to work with this. Fortunately for him, he's in his own vehicle. He doesn't have to do be out in the public. Like, he's out in the public, but he's not met with people. Like me, I was meeting with, uh, it was about 41 guys on the job I was on. So, you know, I'm constantly, constantly keeping my distance, watching people. Um, they wanted me to get on the bus uh, yesterday, and I got on the bus. I looked, and there was too many people in there. I stepped off, and I said, no, he can come back and pick me up. So, manager went on the bus, kicked about eight guys off and say you guys only get off too close so anyway hopefully everybody's doing good i know there's a lot of a lot of hype a lot of problems going on um <clears throat> and yeah it's pretty bad um especially what they're predicting um hopefully their prediction's really 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 high about a hundred thousand too high or even 200,000 too high. Um, hopefully they came up with a little antivirus vaccine, I guess. Um, but anyway, uh, just wanted to touch base real quick before I get to it. So, uh, Hot Shot Secrets is having a sale. It's having a deal. I'm not sponsored by them like my buddy Chad Myers, 73. You can go check him out. Um... But anyway, I did enter his coupon code, and I got 10% off. Uh, so I bought four bottles of Everyday Diesel. Everyday Diesel treatment, six in one. One ounce is 25 gallons of fuel treatment, which I use. I buy this stuff from uh, Tractor Supply a lot. And so they were having a deal. I got all four of these. I got all four of these for $68. So they were having a sale. Plus I entered Chad's coupon code. And uh, with his code, it got brought it down to 68 bucks. However, <laughs> as you can see, I'm missing some in here. And I'm missing some in here. So, kid brought it home yesterday. And uh, won't show. it's going to be hard to show the box. Uh, because uh, my address and stuff are on there. As you can see, this box, the paper, everything is just soaked. Um, the bottom is soaked. Doesn't look like there's any damage to the box. Um, there are the labels. Liquid Handle Care. And it says this side up. I don't want to go any lower. Because my address and stuff are on there. Um... But anyway, uh, yeah, I contacted them, or I just messaged them. They said, uh, they have a thing on Instagram, said, last minute, make sure you get your blah, 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 blah. And I said, I got mine, and then I told them what happened, that they apparently leaked in the box. And they said, or somebody said, or it was them, um, they shouldn't leak because they have the foil. Well, they're right, they do have the foil, however... 
when we opened these and I sent them I sent them videos of all of it so yeah you got your aluminum foil and then we'll do this one. Oh, what happened to that aluminum foil <laughs> so if you can see kind of almost see a pattern here if you look at the way that the labels put on labels put on the opening the opening these ones were not that bad um, and what I did to test them was I just pulled up a little bit I was just peeling this up like with the weight of the bottle and uh, this one popped open just a little bit so anyway and then this one that one was good so but this one I didn't see anything leaking but I think if it would have gone a little farther it probably would have started leaking however these two are leaking so I think what's happening is ugh, in their bottling process somehow some way they have the little filler so the bottles they're in a line like this because I've seen assembly lines for filling this stuff um, on some people's videos and their videos and I think even Chad Myers had a video um, the bottles are all in this line assembly line so I think what's happening is they're filling filling it and when they're pulling the thing out or when they're when they're moving to the next one I think a drop maybe might be dropping on that edge of the of the top um, and then when they go when it goes to the next step to seal it I think that liquid or something is still there um, I don't know I'm not I'm just guessing I'm just assuming so anyway uh, I don't really know what they're gonna do I'm missing probably like I told him I was missing probably about eight ounces because these are 32 ounce so um, I'm probably missing you know four ounces out of there four ounces out of there eight ounces which is no big deal because I got a deal um, but yeah so uh, just wanted to do a little video maybe for them maybe for Chad Myers don't go down there and yell at them but uh because of the covid stuff going on but maybe you could talk to some of your people and let them know my thoughts on maybe why it's leaking i did do a video video for them on instagram and showed them what i thought was going on but anyway um but yeah so obviously the foil didn't the foil didn't work um yeah so a lot of stuff on here so I like the product I use the product all the time um, I have three diesels but anyway yeah this stuff it stinks really bad like I don't like the smell of it so when my kid brought it when my kid brought it oh, five dollars off nice um, when he brought it in, I actually could smell it uh, in the house. I was sitting on the couch, and I was like, "I was like, man, what's that smell?" And so I came out here and looked for the uh, Hot Shot Secret Extreme, but I remembered. I thought maybe it fell off and was like spilling somewhere, but I remembered I put it in the toolbox of the Drunken Ram. Um, and then I came out and I was looking, looking, I was like, "Man, what's that smell?" And he came over and he's like. He's all, it's your box. I was like, what? So, anyway. Um, yeah, that's all this video is about. It's just, uh, talking about that while my oil is draining. So, anyway. So, anyway, that's all I got. Everyday diesel, uh, or <laughs> everyday. Everyday diesel treatment from Hot Shot Secrets. Not sponsored. Um... Got 10% off with 10% missing, maybe. Maybe 5% missing. <laughs> Alright, that's all I got, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe. Comment below um, if you guys have any maybe suggestions or issues with Hot Shot Secrets or it could be other companies because I do believe 
that a different company makes that for them. Um, I think they're just partners or something. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Because they told me to email some company. And I emailed some company. And it wasn't their name on the company. But their name was down at the bottom on the company. But anyway. Alright guys. That's going to be it. Subscribe. Comment. Do what you guys do. Later.